Like and subscribe. Um, here to talk about Kevin Durant going to Philadelphia 76ers. Uh, to me, I ain't gonna say to Mike. No, but uh, people were saying that that um, Kevin Durant had a beef with James Harden. Now. They Brett, they back friends now. It's crazy. It's him and Kyrie going through it. Now he want to play on the 76ers. It don't matter if they, he got on the 76ers. They ain't going to do nothing but lose like they been doing. And uh, the thing is, Kevin Durant just need to just face the facts and start trying to run to other people's teams and stay on his own team and build his own team. That he ain't going to do no better if he join with other people. I know they be trying to make this story up that if Kevin Durant go to another team, it's his team. You already got your own team right now. They gave you everything, and you still trying to run. Just stay where you at. You just – these players is too – I ain't going to say the players is too – Overpower with try to be in control. They supposed to be in control because they they get broadcast to be stars, but and they use their name. But I I understand, but it just take the fun out of the game that they control everything. Like I understand is it's like it's their job. You know what I'm saying? It's how they make their living. They got to deal with it, but it's just as a fan perspective is not fun watching and hearing about it it's news because everybody is excited just to um hear it because they they like listen to sports and playing it and um watching it but not really watching it but it everybody watched the the nba in the playoffs but kevin Durant, if you go to the seven sisters even though I don't believe he going to the 76 to play with James Harden because he was, he was mad. You already, they already showed that tape um, with, um, what was that um, show called? Uh, whatever that um, Chris, Chris Bessard show with the other dude. I, I don't remember his name, but they showed that. I don't know, was it yesterday or this morning? But the point they showed that in the All Star game when he's making his selection with James Harden, they he did it on purpose because he didn't want he's mad because he left. But I don't understand why he would get mad that he want to leave and this dude, um, Kyrie, trying to have all the attention on him so he could wreck the team because he want to be. The um leader of the team. He know Kevin Durant is the franchise player. He is his team, but he want to be. He want to be his team, and that ain't gonna work out with him going to team up with LeBron again. I don't know why they think LeBron control. He could control Kyrie. He could, he couldn't extend Kyrie when Kyrie was on his team. That's why he tried to trade him. Cause I don't, I don't I don't see no reason why he would want to go back um, to LeBron. I understand cause somewhat cause he don't like his situation in Brooklyn, and LeBron don't like his situation with uh, his current situation with his team. But he he can't get mad either cause it's, he 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 to blame for that. He wanted all them players on his team. Then you want to trade everybody. Like, that's stupid, dog. Huh? Face your fate. Take it like a man. Stop running. But like I'm saying, um, Kevin Durant, if he go to the 76ers, they ain't going to win. Who going to – it's too much um, players that need to get the ball. I know they want their numbers. That's how they get paid. If they don't have them numbers that they get – that they get on the regular, they ain't getting the checks that they want. That's why James Harden ain't get what he want, because he's playing like trash. 
even though he's scoring 20 points. But he wasn't really, I mean, he's averaging 20 points, but it didn't really matter because he wasn't getting that every game. That's just an average. He sometimes get 20. But like I was saying, Kevin Durant, stop running. And I'm out.